Welcome to Draw Kids, where anyone can draw. Today we're going to draw Branch from the movie Trolls. I love Branch because he's a lot like me. Rough and tumble on the outside, but warm and fuzzy on the inside. So grab your art supplies and let's draw. So here we go, drawing Branch from the movie Trolls. And Branch will be about this size. Uh, what we want to do is we want to start about his nose. So that'll be out in the middle of the page. Now you know Branch has got a, a big funny nose. So what we're going to do is we're going to do like an upside down U. Like that. On this side, we're going to do the letter C. On the bottom side, we're going to do a U. Make it a little bit longer going that way. Perfect. On the back side, we're going to do a backward C. Good job. Next, we're going to do his eyes. So his eyes are going to be kind of close together. They're going to be little ovals like this. One on each side. Perfect. And we'll make his eyelids about halfway. Good. Inside, we're going to do circles for his eyes. And then we'll go ahead and color those in. Leave a little spot for the shine of his eye. Good. Next, we're going to do his eyebrows. This one is going to be like a rainbow up, up above the right eye. And this one's going to be a little bit lower. You know Branch likes to make that little funny smirk. Good. Now, on this side, what we're going to do is we're going to draw the back of his smile like that. And then we're going to do a long U coming to almost this nostril. Good. After that, let's start on the top of his head. So about from here to here, we're going to do a rainbow shape. Good. Now on this side, we're going to do his cheek. We're going to do his cheek all the way to this other side. So do like the letter C, but kind of long. And then on this side, we're just going to do kind of a long, long chin. Good. Now after this hump, we're going to do an, another little hump like that. And now we're going to do his ear. So his ear is kind of like a, a curve, like a rainbow. And then we're going to close it off. Good. So this same shape we're going to do on this side. Right about, right about where this little cheek mark is. So go ahead and do that little curve there. And curve it in and down. Good. So for the inside of his ear, we'll do like a little, a little swoosh like that. And uh, kind of like that. I'll same thing on this side, a little curve and a little swoosh. Good job. So now his hair, his hair is going to be just above his ears and it's going to kind of curve out a little bit and it's going to go almost to the top of the page. So we'll do this first line, curve out and curve up, almost to the very top of the page. Same on this side, curve out and curve in. Good. Now so for the top, we just make like a jagged line. Kind of make different sizes. I'll wait till you get to the other side. Good job. So next we're going to do his collar. So his collar is like, like that. It's kind of like a v-neck here in the front, right underneath his chin. Good. Now close that line off. Good. So they'll go to the other side, his other shoulder, and then just close that. Good job. Next we're going to make his arm. So his arm's going to come down like a curve, almost like a J. And then we'll curve it up to about there. And the other side of his arm will start here. Like this is where the front of his arm is. And we'll go down to about here. And then we're going to curve this out. Good. So his arms are crossed. So this will look like a, his wrist is coming out. And we'll follow this line around to be the outside of his arm. And let's connect that with his shoulder. Good. And then this will be kind of up to his elbow to where the bend is. Good job. Next we're going to do his back. So we'll take this line all the way down. He kind of has a little, a little hump for where his little bum is. And then we'll kind of go all the way down to his foot. Good. So about right here in the middle, we'll do kind of here where the bottom of his body is. And we'll start this other leg. Going down. Curve this around like a foot. And we're going to take this all the way down to his toe. So do a little backward C for his toe. And then close that off. Next, we're going to do four more toes, just like this one. One, two, three, oh, just three more. That's four. So from here, the pinky toe to the top or the top of his foot. Good. Now we're going to do the front side. So follow this curve to like where the top is, where his body ends and his leg starts. Now we'll keep this nice and straight. From here, we'll do the bottom of his foot, kind of give it a little curve. And then do a big toe. And then three more. One, two, three. 
Good. Now we're going to do a, a nice little curve to close that off. Good job. So the bottom of this pants leg, it has a little bit of a jagged edge to it. So pretend like it's a straight line. So we imagine a straight line there, but every so often give it a little, a little jagged. Same with the other side. So pretend it's going to be a straight line, but every so often give it a little. Perfect. So there's Branch. Hope you had fun. Let's color him and we'll see you on the other side. I hope you had a good time drawing with us. I hope your branch came out really good. Post them in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye.